This tutorial is completely dedicated to installing MySQL on your Ubuntu machines. So the first command you need to execute on your terminal is sudo apt get update. Before installing anything, we need to update our computers. So file that command, give your password, and let the process do its working. Now the updation of our computer has been done. This will take different amount of time on being when your computer was updated. Now to install MySQL, you need to write sudo apt get install mysql server. This will take 129 MB of additional disk space. Yes. Now this process has also been started so I will pause my video for a few seconds so that it doesn't make really long and you only see the stuff is being downloaded. Now after a few things have been downloaded you will be able to see this configuring MySQL server 5.7 which is the latest one right now dialog box here so you need to provide here your password and do remember that every time you log in into the mysql command prompt you would be asked this password so provide your password over here repeat password for mysql root okay so done so now this process is pre-configuring what packages it has fetched Okay, so this process is finished. So now let's see whether our MySQL has been properly configured and installed or not. So on your command prompt, write down mysql-u root, which is the username and dash p, and provide the password which you have just given while installing MySQL. And boom! Our MySQL is successfully installed. To see if there are the inbuilt databases. So let's find the command show databases. And you have an error in MySQL syntax. Yeah, I've messed up the spelling of databases. And yeah, there you can see information schema, MySQL performance schema, and sys. So this was it, guys. The configuration and installing of our MySQL has been properly done and from the next tutorials we can shoot up and really see and learn things in my sql so thank you bye bye tune in like subscribe and share